Good morning, everyone. Well, I've gotten off to a slow start this year. I had all these plans and was going to improve my website and all that and get one video up and then I get sick. So yesterday I couldn't even hardly talk. And that was when I was going to uh, do a video on uh, several things. But today's another day. Uh, my head is still just throbbing. But uh, I'll try and get through this video without sneezing on any of you. So this video is um, the heart clothespin embellishment swap on minialbumscraps.com. And what you do is you make three sets of three close heart shaped clothes pins and um, send them in and you get three different sets back from other people so these are the three clothes pins that I made there were there were certain requirements that you had to um, to use some of them I fulfilled, a couple of them I really didn't because it didn't fit into what I was doing. And I think they came out pretty despite the fact that I left a couple things off. But on this first one up here on the top, I used washi tape on the clothespin, both sides. And then I used a heart foam uh, a foam heart and then a glittered foam heart and then another patterned foam heart and a piece of yarn that I just tied in a knot and then at the top I have a resin flower in red and then on this one over here I used a foam, glittered foam white heart, um, a pink foam heart, and a solid pink foam heart. I used some little flowers up here, and I used one of the little um, blocks, and it says laugh. And I put some eyelash trim in pink. I tied it in a bow, and I put it at the bottom. And I also used washi on the clothespin here as well. All three of them have a different kind of washi on them. So there's that one. And then this third one over here, I used washi for the clothespin. I used a red foam heart, a pink patterned foam heart, a white patterned foam heart. I tied a, a little pink bow with uh, the eighth inch satin ribbon and I put a satin flower at the top. So that's that one. So those are my three. The presentation piece is um, two different pattern papers, one on the front and one on the back with a piece of uh, lightweight uh, cardboard in between. Then I punched two holes, one on each side of each one of the clothespins, and I ran a twisty tie through it. I ran it through the, the uh, spring <coughs> on the clothespin and twisted it on the back to hold them on the presentation piece. Then I created this bag to put them in and it just has a piece of washi across the middle and one of the cutouts from the paper pad that I used for the the backing on the uh, the tag or on the presentation. I cut out one of my uh, bag toppers in red and I put a label on it saying what the swap is and on this particular one, I put a piece of double stick tape up here 
because I need to leave it open so that Mary can videotape it and then she'll pull the top off of the tape and finish sealing up the bag. The other two are sealed all the way. So that is my uh, submission for the um, heart clothespin embellishment. And again, that was that is on uh, manyalbumscraps.com. So let me know if you like them. Um, I had a lot of fun making them. Uh, one of the requirements, as I said, was that you were supposed to use at least two flowers. Well, two flowers would have been too much on my hearts because I used three different hearts. So I kind of uh, took that as uh, multiple embellishments. And you were also supposed to use a piece of lace, which I didn't use a piece of lace, but I did use ribbon or eyelash trim on each one of them. So again, I feel that I fulfilled the requirement. Um, sometimes the requirements, just sometimes, but sometimes the requirements are suggestions because they don't want just simple um, cardboard heart glued to a clothespin type thing. They want it embellished to a certain extent so that everybody basically does the same thing. So anyway, that is my, uh, my entry and I have several other videos to do today so I will see you again in a little bit.